everyone. So today we are doing a very exciting video. <laughs> hey y'all, just a warning. I was sick when filming this, so I'm gonna edit it like a lot, make it more interesting because I am honestly like not that interesting this video, so. Time to edit. Today we are doing something that I was actually hoping to post like three weeks ago, but um, sometimes it just doesn't work out like that. So I'm posting it now. Hopefully you guys are still interested in seeing about these mystery boxes Jeffree Star launched. Uh, this was his second launch of mystery boxes, I believe. He did one a while ago and I tried to get those, but my calendar didn't alert me when the launch was happening. But this time for the Valentine's Day mystery boxes, I made darn sure that I had it written in my calendar, so I got them. So if you guys are confused and have no idea what these mystery boxes are, basically, Jeffree Star, he's a YouTuber, you probably know him, um, he has a makeup company, obviously, and this makeup company launched mystery boxes, basically, and instantly I was intrigued because I love mystery boxes, and especially when it's from like a brand that you really like, like Jeffree Star Cosmetics, I was just excited because like the surprise of makeup that you didn't order, but like, I don't know. If you understand, you understand. Needless to say, I was excited about the launch, so I did in fact buy both of the mystery boxes. There is a bigger option, which is this one, and then a smaller one. Different price points, both fairly reasonable for what you're supposed to get in them. It's supposed to be a better value to buy it in the mystery box. The only thing is that obviously you're not choosing everything. I will say in the big mystery box, you do pick a size. So I'm assuming there's clothes in here. I picked a size small because that's my size. But yeah, I think without further ado, I'm sure why you clicked on this video is because you too are curious what is in this mystery box. I know I'm a little late to the game. I honestly just received the big one in the mail like three days ago. So this was like, as soon as I could do it. But uh, let's, let's just dive in. Let's see what we got in these mystery boxes. I am so excited, you guys. All right, so we will start off with the little one. Here is the size of it. As you can see, it has the Jeffree Star signature print on it right here and then a bunch of question marks because you don't know what's inside. Also, excuse my nails, I started rock climbing so I had to cut the claws off and honestly I don't miss them that much but I do miss having my nails look good so. With that. Please just look away from the nails. I did watch mystery box unboxings of the last launch, but this is a different launch and I have yet to see people unboxing them. I'm sure that there are some out there. I just didn't want to look at them because I wanted to be surprised just in case it's the same thing in all the boxes. So I have literally no idea what's in here. Okay, so inside there is some pink tissue paper. And okay, so everything's in here. Oh my gosh, you guys. There are so many products in here. What the heck? There's like, okay, I'm guessing four lip products, a highlight, and also a pop socket. I won't be needing the pop socket though. I have literally the best pop socket ever. It's my little puppy, Scooby. But that is nice to have a pop socket. I wonder if the head is replaceable, but it's a Jeffree Star pop socket. I don't think he ever launched pop sockets, so this must be like an exclusive for in the mystery boxes, unless he's planning on launching pop sockets. Honestly, I bet you my mom wants this because she like likes pop sockets. Oh my gosh, you guys, I'm so excited. I love Jeffree Star's makeup products, but the thing is, is I never seem to buy anything. I have a few things here and there, but I definitely just don't, don't like buy up collections. So I'm so excited to have some of the collection. So by the looks of things, there are some pretty like colors I would wear other than this one which uh, I'm gonna open up. So let's start with this um, Jeffree Star Lip Ammunition in the shade Starfish. The lip ammunitions are his lipsticks. So he has liquid lipsticks that were launched before and the lip ammunitions are newer. Uh, they're more like just like a lipstick bullet. And when I say lipstick bullet, they're legit shaped like a bullet. That packaging is so iconic and like everything about the pink is iconic. Also, this is not sponsored. Jeffree Star doesn't know I'm doing this. Based on Starfish, I'm guessing a pink and oh my gosh. That is such a freaking pink, like Patrick Star pink from Spongebob. That is like literally a color swatch of Patrick Star. 
Just a smidge off. It sounds funny saying Patrick Star because like there's a YouTuber Patrick Star, but I'm almost always talking about SpongeBob Patrick Star. Okay, I'm gonna quickly insert a video of me putting this on on my lips to see what it looks like, and then on to the next thing. As you can see, the color difference, like this is white packaging versus his normal pink packaging. I'm pretty sure that this was the Christmas collection that he did in 2018. I don't know, correct me if I'm wrong, but uh, it's definitely different. Like it's from a collection of some sort. So I'm wondering if it's like the stock that didn't sell, they're putting in mystery boxes. Either way, I think it's a really, really, really smart business tactic because if you have like a couple that like won't sell you just put them in the mystery boxes but okay here is the one color that's scaring me it's called triggered and uh it looks like a dark dark purpley brown color so let's let's see the liquid lipstick like casing is white and it has this like iridescent sparkles on it you can see better in the close-up but it's really really pretty and oh my gosh this color it looks like it's gonna be like a purple. I'm gonna quickly put it on my lips and see what it looks like. I'm really excited to have that. Usually I would say I'm just gonna like give them away if it's color I don't think I'd wear, but honestly, I just like, I wanna keep it. Okay, and now getting away from the other collection, I'm just gonna go in here. This is a watermelon soda. I'm pretty sure this was in a summer collection launch. Again, I'm not sure. I don't really, I honestly am not sure. Oh my goodness, this looks like the same as the lip ammunition, but it is a liquid lipstick. It's this really, really pretty like fuchsia pink. Definitely looks like a starfish color, so okay. Another one, I'll put that on. All right, and then we got Can't Relate. Based on the color swatch, it looks like it's gonna be like a My Nude type color. So that's good. I definitely don't have any of these thus far, so that's nice. I'm so obsessed with the pink packaging, but the white packaging is so nice as well. And same, oh yeah, just like a nude color. Again, I will put it on. My lips are probably dying at this point of putting on all these liquid lipsticks because they are just so strong on the mouth. Okay, and then the only face product we have is a Jeffree Star Cosmetics Skin Frost. I only have one of these and it's Princess Cut and it is so blinding, like honestly. So I'm interested to see what this color is. It looks like Deep Freeze is gonna be like a blue color. So let's see. Oh my gosh, I was not expecting that blue. Holy crap, that is so freaking cool. Okay, I'm gonna put it on my face. Honestly, I'd probably use this more as an eyeshadow rather than a highlight, but I'm kind of trying to broaden my horizon of makeup, hence the yellow in the inner eye corner. I know I'm so daring with my makeup, but uh, I think that these types of things will like push me out of my comfort zone a little bit to try them. That is everything, four lip products, one face, and a pop socket in the small box. That is pretty good. I think that's quite a good bang for your buck. For sure, to be able to try out some more products, that is awesome. So now, into the big one. Same exact thing, open it up. It's got the tissue paper, pull it out, and oh my goodness, there is way more stuff in here. I mean, it is the bigger one, but still. Oh my gosh, I just saw a Supreme Frost. Oh my goodness, I wanted, I want, I want, I wanted one so bad. 
My camera can't even focus, it's excited too. Okay, but first thing I see, pop socket. I'm gonna be gifting out Jeffree Star pop sockets for a real one. <laughs> okay, so what I see in here is five lip products. Um, two face products, I'm so excited about that skin, Supreme Frost, and a shirt. So let's see what it is. I can kind of see can't relate, so let's just see. I honestly really, really like this. I think I might want to crop it just because I way wear cropped things more than normal size shirts, but I love the colors. I'm like in love with pink, so this definitely works good for me. It's almost like Jeffree handcrafted this box for me. Shall I put it on? I will. Can't relate. I never wear like just full on t-shirts, but this is pretty nice. He's snapping. Can't relate. Oh my word. I'm just looking at the colors that we got. Oh my gosh. Like that is going to be so fun. Okay. Oh my goodness. What should we open first? I think we should open this. It's a lip liner and it's in the shade Unicorn Blood. And Unicorn Blood, I'm pretty sure is like a quite popular one of Jeffrey's things. I'm like ripping into it. Like now I can't even, I can't video and do this at the same time. Like I'm just like freaking out. So I have one uh, lip liner and the lids are just iconic. Look at me, look at me showing. So Unicorn Blood is kind of like a deep, dark brownish red. So that's really nice. I never would have usually bought that for me, but it's probably good that I have a darker lip liner because I tend to just have nudes. So that's good. And again, we've got a different collection. This was actually when he launches, I remember, because I remember thinking the light pink was the prettiest yet. Like, I just love light pink. Love the hot pink, but like the light pink is just like, in my opinion, just so pretty. And this is Diamond, so named after one of his little dogs. That is like a periwinkle color. Oh my word. This is another one. I would never have bought this, but I'm so excited to have that. Okay, I'm gonna put it on my lips. Okay, and then we got another one just from the basic packaging and this is in the shade Dream House. Let's see what this one looks like. Oh my gosh. Okay, you guys, I had completely forgotten about this. This was a color I literally almost ordered and then I was like, Mia, you don't need it, just stop. And now I got it. The world has went full circle. Very glad about that. I'm gonna put it on for you. And then we got Posh Spice. I hear about this one a lot, being a really nice shade. So let's just see. Oh. That's gonna make my teeth really yellow, but it might just be worth it for the look. And that's the thing, like none of them smell like they're expired. I honestly think it's just extra stock that he's putting in, so that's good. All right, and then we got Jeffrey's Girl. That is such a cool name for a lipstick. I really, really, really like that. I don't know, it just has a good flow to it. This is a lip ammunition, so it's shaped like a bullet again. Oh my gosh, that is such a Barbie pink. Girl, I'm gonna have to really step out with my lip colors coming up quick here. Like, never again. We're never wearing a light pink again. Only fuchsia pinks or blues now. <laughs> All right, so now we got some face stuff. I've got the Jeffree Star Skin Frost in Lavender Snow. Now I have seen this one, I've seen this one for a long time. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. All right, now the moment I've been waiting for, adorable packaging on this. Take a look. This is in the shade Frozen Peach. I'm actually, I might have, that might have been the one I almost bought once. So, and this is matte. So this is like really nice feeling. I'm so excited for this. This is so nice. It's got little stars in it. Like a big star, but then little stars. I want, I want, I want, I want. 
So I will put all the money that you save on the screen right now because I'm honestly very curious to see like what it actually would have costed if you cost what it would have cost. I always say that wrong. If you would have bought the pieces individually. So here they are on the screen. This is how much money we'd be saving having these mystery boxes. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this fun little video. If you guys want to see more unboxing videos or like reviews of new makeup, let me know down below what you want to see next. I'm kind of in a makeup shopaholic mood. Like every time something new is launched, I just like, I don't know. I'm like really on the prowl or something. But yeah, thank you guys so, so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to click the subscribe button. I post on Fridays and Sundays and I would like to see you there. So yeah, I'll see you in the next one. Bye. <laughs>